Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm sorry for not uploading over the past week and nearly two weeks. Been super busy with New Year and everything like that. Uh, but anyway, we are back today. It is Double XP weekend if you haven't already known. And if you haven't hopped on, make sure you do because it is Double XP weekend. But before we do start this video, make sure you guys do go down below and hit that subscribe button. It does mean a lot to me. We're pumping out some awesome Modern Warfare content. This year it's going to be insane. Um, but as you can see, I'm ranked 155 right now. Essentially, max rank, if you will. Um, and last year, after you completed it, rank, well, not last year, last season, uh, season zero, if you completed rank 155, then you unlocked the OG M4 variant, M4A1 variant, whatever it is. Uh, and it was the M16, like the original M16 skin of Modern Warfare, the original game. So I don't know what you unlocked this year, th what this season, should I say? Uh, no idea. So we're going to hop on to some tw uh, shipment 24/7. Hopefully we can, uh, you know, rank up to 156. Technically, won't say that, but it will be, uh, and see if we do unlock anything cool. I have no idea. I've not seen a video on this, but anyway, let's just do it. Okay, we should hopefully reach it this game. I hope. I've been playing a lot of hardcore recently. The simple reason is going for these camos for the Damascus. You can get them so much easier in hardcore, and the spawn traps on this map in hardcore are ten times better. Um, for simple fact, you can kill him one bullet, and, but it is annoying. As you can see, I'm getting absolutely ruined. Like he's gonna get fair mattered. Um, but yeah, we're halfway through the ARs. If you want to see a bit of progress on that, how that's going, then let me know. I'll do that. But um, yeah, it's going pretty well. It's annoying as hell. The long shots for these guns are just annoying. The most annoying thing ever, and they take ages to do. And I don't even know. It's just frustrating. I've been times where I've not even wanted to do it. I thought, oh, you know what? I'm not bothered with this anymore. I'm just going to chill out, just play the game. But then, no. Except I've started it. I've got to finish it. I've also been doing the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, I forget what they're called. The, the challenges you get through ranking up and you get the ribbons and the emblems. Uh, I've nearly managed to do them all. Um, just by playing. They're really easy, actually. You know, if you just sort of read through them and actually have a look and just change your class to them. Like, get kills with a certain perk or call in like, I don't know, get fit, cruise missiles or something like that, easy to do. Honestly, really easy. I think the hardest challenge on there uh, would probably be to be calling a support helo. Obviously, you've got to get a 12 kill streak. Um, I was about to say the merciless killer one where you have to get merciless. But, uh, obviously, the support helo is more kills. Them kids are going to get killed. Oh, man. I'm going to have to get in a bit ruined right now, but... I'm not too forced, I just want to get this max rank and see what actually unlocks and then probably, depending if it's a weapon we unlock, we'll probably try it out, depending on what it is. And I just want to talk about the ranking system in this game as well because it is, and I got team killed, wow, cheers, mate. Because uh, it's just it's just not good the way it's ranked, I mean, in fact, I'll probably talk about it now. Like, why is it in the prestige in? I'm max rank now, there's like 30 days until rank resets. So, what, well, I can't sprint. What? What's going off? I'm froze. What? Oh. Brilliant. Horrendous spawn trap. Shipment summed up right here. Wow. 
been in that game 30 seconds join late two kills and just got my heart I must have died I don't know 20 times in 30 seconds 27 I was close There we go, we've just ranked up in game 156. So let's hope. Let's hope, hope, hope after I'm getting spawn trapped and spawn trapped on this map that we unlock something decent and we'll play a different map for it instead of shipment because I can't give an accurate, accurate representation. Every gun is amazing on shipment, let's be honest. Uh, but yeah, hopefully it's decent. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, and then we're probably going to have a little rant about the ranking up system that's been on my mind uh, which I thought would, would have been changed uh, when I first heard about it in the game but it hasn't which is annoying okay we're back in the lobby unlocked is the warhead light machine gun let's take a look at that real quick I think it is the P a PKM variant to be fair no it's not it is an M91 variant this is it which, if you ask me, is very, very disappointing. I mean, you grind all the way to max rank uh, to unlock this. Uh, the rant I wanted to talk about was the, um, you know, let's go into rank progression so we can see. The no prestige in this game. So you get to, this is why I think there's no point in even being double XP weekend this weekend. Because, as you can see, they've got 23 days. Overall, I think it was something like... We'll say 50 days, roughly, some maybe even 60 days to get from 55 to 155. So you've got to rank up 100 times. Yes, it does get a lot of XP towards the end, but it's nothing you can't do in 60 days. It's easy. I've done it 23 days to spare. Uh, people have done it way before me, and people are probably still trying to go for it. But in the 60 day period, without double XP, it is very, very easily obtainable. And once you hit it, that's it. You'll have to wait 23 days now before I can rank up again. But I'm going to get D ranked to 55, then back up to 155 again. And the only thing I do unlock whilst in this process are these stupid challenges, which are easy. You get five headshots with your secondary weapon. I think that's like level 150 or 149. Um, 150 is deploy five sentry guns. So the challenges don't get harder. You don't unlock anything cool apart from the things at the bottom of the screen. Uh, they are little emblems, if you didn't know, for just show you real quick. These are the little emblems you unlock. They look awful. I mean, that's what it's meant to be. You do the challenges and you can show off a cool looking emblem. If you ask me, that looks absolutely dreadful. Uh, the emblem I've got on right now, it was a free emblem and I think it's one of the best emblems in the game in terms of looking cool. These are the ones before. I didn't hardly do any in the previous season. Uh, the end, the last, if you completed all the challenges for season zero, you did get a pretty cool moving one, which was pretty cool. But this time around, it doesn't move. It's just a stationary um a stationary uh, like little emblem thing. I can't show you right now because I'm not quite unlocked yet. I'm pretty close. Uh, not many challenges left now, and they are pretty easy. But I would love to just add um, prestige into the game. Sort of give it a grind factor. Like Black Ops 4 when it came out, I was just wanting to play just to prestige, just to rank up. Where this game, you don't even have to rush. You don't even have to rush. I've seen a lot of people saying when you do unlock uh, Damascus Camo, which I'll show on the screen. Uh, that's pretty much it. There's nothing else to really do, and it doesn't even look that cool, as you can see on my MP7 right now. It does look a little bit better in game, um, but it doesn't. There's nothing special about it. It's just a camo. It's just a camo. I mean, there's better camos that I've, that I've been in before. I mean, that is the equivalent to diamond camo, platinum. If you didn't know, it looks awful. This game, there's nothing to really go for apart from Damascus. I, I wish there was ten prestiges and a thousand levels like there's been for the last couple of years. It just so when you've done everything, like the camos, like the dark matter camos. Then you can grind the levels and you just try and reach the highest rank as you possibly can in a given time in the year. Um, and so I had a really fun factor, um, but there's nothing like that this time round. I've got all the way to 155, wasn't that hard, just casually playing. I mean, I've not even played that much this time round as of right now, this season anyway. Uh, and I got a Warhead M91 LMG variant, which I'm never going to use apart from when I go and get the gold camo on it. I get the gold camo on it and I'll never ever touch that weapon again. As will the majority of players. Uh, I don't even know. It's nothing. It'd be cool if you could get like um, I don't know, a camo or something like that, just to show off. 
Whereas the one, if someone's using that Warhead variant in game, I'm not gonna know what it is. I'm not gonna care. I'm not bothered. It's an M91 variant. It looks a bit orange. I mean, what does it look like again? It's got a little bit of yellow tint to it. it looks, it, it looks like this. Go to the store real quick. Where is it? Where are they? Is it this one? It looks like this that you can buy. Um, it looks awful. And I mean, I don't know. It needs to be, I just want prestige in this game. Why there isn't, why the fuck that was a good idea not to add prestige in, I will never know. Stupid decision. But anyway, I'm going to have to end the video here before I got ranting a little bit too much and record another video. I'm going to do two videos today, so I might see a double upload, might not. It'll probably be tomorrow if it's not today. Um, but anyway, so if you want to miss, if you don't want to miss that video, make sure you do hit that subscribe button down below. And make sure you do have bell notifications turned on. And uh, yeah, make sure you drop a like, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.